Answer Coalition who demonstrates uh, for free Palestine. They bring in Muslim illegals and they're, and they're arguing to bring in illegals and to fight Israel. Where does Israel fit in the LGBT uh, position vis-a-vis -vis Palestine and the rest of the Muslim world? Whoa, so I think this organization, like, it's pretty much wrong. It's not, like, I, this whole free Palestine and anti, like, Israel stuff, it's just, it needs to stop. Like, Israel is the only country in the Middle East where we can have parades, for example. You can't do that anywhere in the Middle East other than Israel. And these people stand for those things. These people stand for anti-LGBT, they want they want to bring in radical Islamic terrorists. They know that, and these organizations are funded by George Soros. And I think at the end of the day, we have to make sure we fight these organizations because these organizations are dangerous and these organizations do not stand for American values and they will put our countries, our country and our communities at risk, plain and simple. We want to make sure that people are able to live the lives they want and radical Islam Sharia law, all that stuff, that doesn't make that doesn't make us feel safe. That does not make us feel like we can be out in a parade and express ourselves. And I think this I think these organizations stand for that. And I don't think what they're doing is right at all. And to be honest with you, if Hillary was elected, like if Hillary would have won, I would have been a lot more scared. But now that I know that Trump is in office, I'm not as scared. I'm actually feel I feel pretty good that Trump has Israel's back, and will make sure that um, Israel has um, our back, uh, has our back, and that we make sure that we stand with them. And I think at the end of the day, um, we have to make sure that Israel stands tall because they are at war constantly, and we have to make sure we have their back all the time. You know about the uh, how Palestinians treat homosexuals? About the what? Palestinians treat homosexuals. I've heard it's bad. I've heard they torture them. I, I've I've seen a lot of things on like YouTube and things that they have told me on Facebook and stuff that I researched. Like, <coughs> to me, there is no such thing as a moderate Muslim. There is no such thing as a moderate Muslim whatsoever. They're all ra they're radical. They're radical. What they believe in is very radical. Um, we saw that with the Ariana Grande concert attack. We saw that in London. Like we're seeing that. In, we saw that in Orlando. Like we have to. We have to fight this. And I think what they do and what their religion preaches is not good. And I think that we have to make sure we stop this, and we have to make sure we fight it as well. And we have to make sure we stand against Sharia law in America, and make sure it does not come to our communities whatsoever.